Hello, my name is Natalie Kankan. This is Quiet Orient Riot, and I'd like to read the opening poem. The bread is flat in my hand. To say I once wrote an email to Mahmoud Darwish, I don't know if he saw about being newly arrived in the occupied territories before I knew to call it territory. The bread is flat in my hand and it's a flawless kilometer to a friend's house. A taxidermied giraffe in Qalqilia I haven't seen yet and a progressive progesterone protocol I haven't tried yet and he's not yet a dead poet. I began writing the poems for this book some eight or nine years ago. I was newly arrived in the U.S. at that point with my husband and two daughters um, and found myself, I found myself um, completely unsettled and in deep grief. We'd been living in Ramallah in the West Bank for the better part of a decade before then and I'd gotten married there and had my children there. All the goodnesses of my life had happened there and we'd been forced to leave and made to leave. Um, and so I was grieving and I started writing poems to home. I was writing poems to Ramallah in my mind and on paper and soon those poems turned into a small pile and into a, into a manuscript. Um, what, the poem, what the poems were trying to do and what I was trying to do was make, make sense of my own situation and unsettledness and also trying to connect my story of motherhood, of coming into motherhood through fertility treatment in Palestine, in the Holy Land, to a larger story about uh, counting the arithmetics, the religious, religio-political arithmetic of counting. Because arguably the questions about how many Palestinians there are in the West Bank inside Israel or historic Palestine inside Gaza um, is among if not is the most um, politicized demographic question in the world and so I wanted to tie a personal story about uh, bearing a child with that story uh, the story of counting who counts who gets to count um, and also to recount to recount that birth as important and as a map for my daughter and for her sister so that they can find their way home as they grow older. Um, some of the challenges connected with publishing the book was initially the, the intimate matter of, of writing about fertility treatments and pregnancy um, and then publishing that. And importantly, to write a book from Palestine in English um, in a country where speaking out about or speaking about Palestinian basic right, Palestinian humanity in the face of occupation and war and apartheid, where that can carry real risk to someone's livelihood and career and uh, reputation. Um, I hope that the sounds of Quiet Orient Riot will will move and transport you for a moment and that the book will open up new questions and doors for you. Thank you for reading.